For the second year in a row, West Side Road may once again be labeled the worst road in the province, as a survey published by BCAA comes to a close. For the last month, voters have been casting their ballot for the worst road when it comes to safety, congestion or potholes. And West Side Road is topping the list for what needs to be improved. Certainly there's a lot of competition for highway improvement projects around the province and road safety is one of the principal things that we measure highway improvements around the province. So certainly on any of the numbered routes, uh, there's always a competition. However, over the last three years, the province invested $8 million into improving West Side Road. Along with the Minister of Transportation, we've uh, uh, added pullouts along the roads. Second part is that there's two fairly significant uh, uh, road improvements this year, uh, Blue Grouse and uh, Cinnabar Creek, which are two fairly significant. They're over four and a half million dollars of straightening and removing corners. The speed limit along West Side Road is 70 kilometers an hour, but after spending just several minutes alongside this roadway, it's clear many drivers are going much faster than that. But there's a lot of people that live on this road that know it so well, so they feel that they can just drive it as fast, as quick as they want, and, you know, at their own risk, so it kind of worries other people as well. It's very narrow, and it's, it's very difficult to pass other vehicles, and it's very difficult to drive on it. Basically just a matter of making sure you're mindful of traffic and traveling at a safe rate of speed. I think that's what a lot of the accidents that are happening out here are definitely caused by excessive speed. Accidents like the three-car collision that happened on Sunday, sending one woman to hospital. And with summer quickly approaching, more drivers will be traveling along West Side Road, which could mean an increase in accidents. However, if the road takes the title of worst road in the province, the hope is more people will pay attention to speed limits and conditions as they embark down this dangerous roadway. Jen Zielinski in West Kelowna for Castanet News.